Well, welcome back to Live at 5 at 4. And by the way, happy St. Patrick's Day to you. I'm sure many of you are spending this at home, but hopefully you're surrounded by friends or family um, as we all social distance. But the people, while they're away, certainly the animals will play. That's the case at Zoo Knoxville. Emily DeVoe tells us that the apes at Zoo Knoxville had their own St. Patrick's Day party, even though the zoo is closed to visitors. Even though the zoo is closed, the zookeepers still have to come in to take care of all the animals. So why not make a party of it? We love throwing parties up here at Great Apes, so you'll often see a party theme, whether it's a color or a holiday or anything like that. We've often got a party at least probably once a week on one side or the other. <laughs> yeah, this morning, um, celebrating St. Patrick's Day, we decided to make it fun and enriching for the animals. We did a lot of green themed, white. Um, we'll do some yellows and golds later on this afternoon. We like for them to be physically stimulated as well as mentally. We need them to figure out puzzles, move all their joints, make sure they're active and exploring and using their brains as well as staying full and happy. We need them to uh, look around, make sure they're engaging with their environments and doing all those sorts of things. So we do lots of different types of enrichment, whether it's a puzzle feeder, straight paper, straight snacks, or something a little bit more difficult where we hide food in something else so they have to take it apart or figure that out too. But when you open the door, it's kind of like opening the door to a party or a surprise, and they get all excited and they run out, especially the babies. They really like to interact with their environments as soon as they see everything. So it's kind of fun to watch them run full tilt slam into each other or a beam or kind of slip and fall and pretend like it didn't happen. They shake it off and the moms just kind of come sauntering out like, here we go. <laughs> we have some um, new trays that we ordered. We like to keep enrichment new for keeper staff to keep our minds sharp as well, as well as the animals. So we probably put a smear on it, um, whether it's honey or peanut butter or jelly or something kind of small. Even though the zoo is closed, we are making up for it by throwing parties, doing fun Facebook lives, and then keeper staff gets to kind of enjoy their job as well and we can spend more time with our animals too. Even though you can't visit the zoo right now, you can still visit their Facebook page every day during the week. They're going to be posting a new educational video about the animals. Looks like they enjoyed their party. More live at five and four after a quick break.